Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome once again to Kingfisher's YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like and press the bell icon for up and coming notifications. Today I'm going to be showing you how to tie the FG knot. We don't need any tools for an FG knot. That's what makes it so nice. Guys, all we need is a pair of braid scissors, our line or our braid from our reel. I'm going to be tying it onto a 180 pound, 200 pound uh, rhino braid. The important part of this knot is to make sure that you've got tension on your leader. Okay, so all I'm going to do is I'm just going to drop it on the ground um, so that I've got tension and I'll show you how we tie the knot. All I'm going to do with my leader is I'm going to be using my mouth, it's going to be hard to understand what I'm saying, is we're going to tie a figure of eight over here. All we want to do is create a little bit of a bulge or something that we can hold on to. Okay, so that's pretty much what I'm doing, it's just making a little knot in it. Okay, simple as that, that's all I'm doing. And then I'm going to take my braid leader and wrap it around. And here we go guys. First time I'm going to shut up for a while. So as you can see, all I'm doing is crisscrossing once again. I'll show you how we started off. All we do is we crisscross the line. Okay, so guys, all I'm gonna do is crisscross it six times and then I'm gonna pull it tight. And then I'm just gonna carry on going. Six times, pull it tight. Six times and pull it tight. Once I've done that, I'm gonna do a half hitch and then I'll be able to talk to you. So here we go for quietness. Okay, so now all I'm going to do is do a half hitch around it. And there we go. Now to make sure that it seats properly, I'm going to take my braid and just unwind the whole lot quickly. Let's just unwind it. So now there's the leader going off from my reel down to my leader. And now all we're gonna do is just pull it tight so that it actually locks itself in place. That's half it, and there we go. And then I just continue to do six half hitches around it. There we go. So that's two, and in the opposite direction. Three, four, Five, six. Now to finish it off, we do what they call a reverse risotto, which basically is half hitches again, but one, two, three, four, five, six. Take the tag end and keep it next to the leader 
and then all we do is we just reverse the whole thing once twice three times four five and six now when you pull you'll see how the the braid goes underneath those uh, six little knots that I just tied there we go there we go there we go and you hold tight and pull as tight as you can there we go and we cut off the tag end once again give it a good pull to test it <coughs> okay so there we go there's your FG knot and how an FG knot actually works it's actually braid going over braid there's no knot involved in it it's like a Chinese finger trap you put your finger in and when you pull back it actually holds on to it the exact same principle applies with this knot the more harder you pull in one direction the tighter it actually makes it okay so there it is there, there there's the the fg go into any leading tackle store nationwide and our kingfisher branches there we go guys go out there and enjoy